Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is your boy Ron Tactic, aka Ron Second to None, back with another video for Ron the Four Aquariums, continuing on this shoe live series, which has not been going as best as could because my days get long, they get short, and I don't get a chance to do filming or editing, so I do apologize for being a little off. But I'm going to continue the series, I'm going to do every tank. So, um, this is day five um, of July, so this is the fifth tank. So. What we have here in front of us is a five gallon tank, so let's get started. First line of business is getting water in the tank. Okay, the hole is in the tank, let's get some water. And just like that, we have water going. As always, you guys, I'm not going to bore you with watching water fill up, so I'll cut you back on as it gets closer to the top. about almost a third fill, just shy of halfway, looking like two thirds here, and we're going to about call this here fill okay you guys the tank is filled so now we're on to dechlorinator okay you guys so what i have here for conditioning is my top fan beta water conditioner it makes the tap water safe for fish um it's for beta bowls and aquariums and per directions of the bottle for every one gallon or 3.9 liters you get 12 mil um for every two gallons you get or 7.6 liters you put one mil so it's like a half a mil per gallon this is a five pound tank so five gallons would be two and a half mil Most of the top fans probably come with this graduated top for easy measurement. I know you can't see, I can get the focus. It goes from one, five to 10 mil. So I say we go on two, a two and a half mil, that will be um, just slightly above the first line. Two and a half mil. Okay, you guys, next up we have gravel. And for gravel, I have this top fan underwater world aquarium before non toxic. It's like a um, crushed seashell thing going on. Let's see how it looks. Okay, gravel has been rinsed and in the tank it goes. And just like that, the gravel's in the tank. Next up, on to the core. As for decor, I have these seashells in addition to the crushed seashells, which is the gravel, and also have this lighthouse. Let's see if you can see it. Okay, you guys, the seashells have been rent. Blancher has been cleaned off with alcohol. And just like that, he's at the tank, you guys. He's swimming around, checking things out. Okay, you guys, next up, we have filters. And for filters, I can get the focus. I have this top fan beta flow BF5 quietly filter 20 gallons per hour up to five gallon aquariums, which this is a five gallon and it's great for beta. The filter unbox. Okay, you guys, so the filter's in. Next up is the heater. Here's the heater we're going with. It's rated for a five gallon tank. Okay, you guys, heater's in. Let's get this thing, these things fluffed up. Okay, you guys, the heater's in, filters in, everything's on, lanterns, lanterns glowing. Pretty cool, huh? Let me turn off the lights so you can see it with the lights off.
And as far as for the data, we have the male veil tail. And this is what this little young prince is looking like. We can call him Prince El Edward. Or, yeah, Prince Edward. So let's get him in the tank. Here he is with the lights on, with the aquarium lights on, and everything plugged in. And this is Prince Edward. We're all lights off in the house and just the aquarium light on. As always, I want to thank you guys for coming on this journey with me. Like, don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.